power play to reopen schools in Massachusetts full time. The state gave the Education Commissioner the authority to end remote learning and force students and teachers back to the classroom. As Tiffany Chan reports, the youngest students could return in a matter of weeks. Most school districts are eager to welcome students back into the classroom, but others, especially in urban settings, are really trying to figure out whether they can invite every student back while also socially distancing. It came down to a vote by the State Department of Elementary and Secondary Education to begin phasing out hybrid and remote learning in schools. With the direction of the virus, access to the vaccine, I think this is the right time to be planning for, for this. The goal is to begin with grades K through 8, getting them back into the classroom five days a week. Salem School Superintendent Steve Zreich says this offers much needed clarity, not only for districts, but for families. It brings back some degree of normalcy, um, and there's a lot of planning that needs to be done between now and the, uh, the beginning of April. That includes the health and safety of students and making sure all teachers will be vaccinated on time. We have to really look at our staffing. Uh, we have to look at um, space in our buildings. For many schools, giving students ample space to socially distance will be a challenge. That's the case for Westport Junior Senior High School, where both student bodies share a building. Based on the space limitations of the school, we simply, even at the three foot uh, distance, cannot get our uh, students in at this point full. So we will be filing a waiver with the uh, Department of Elementary and Secondary Education. Along with the districts, parents can also request to keep their child remote for the rest of the school year. More details on the shift to full in-person learning will come next week. But for many superintendents, this is a relief. Look, I mean, as a parent myself, my children um, are, I've never seen them so excited to go to school every day. Governor Charlie Baker issuing a statement applauding today's vote by Desi, saying he's eager to have students back in person learning. From Boston, I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News.